Good day, grade 8. Today is our computer 8 in final week from week 5 for our fourth quarter. Again, my name is Rinaldo B. Malimban. In our objectives, that the student to create a dynamic input object that selection method how to analyze and how to draw it in flash select the various line style and to select the line tool hold down the control key our main topic this uh, our computer is about the drawing to flash in drawing in flash we have the line tool a line tool enables to create a perfectly straight line that extends from the starting point to an end point simply by clicking start position and dragging to the end of position before releasing the mouse just select the line tool and the tools panels and start drawing on the stage like the procedure that in line tool in number one hold down and shift key then click in the starting point in the hold down in mouse button and then drag in your mouse to end point to release the mouse button so why because you can select various line style stroke heights from the properties panel as well as the set of colors with pop up swatches panel or from the stroke color tool and the tool panels and the properties of panel Line tool enable to create perfectly straight line that extends from starting point to an end point. Simply by clicking start position and dragging to it to end the position before the releasing the mouse. So that is the arrow coming from the left side, the line tool. Next is the pencil tool in Photoshop. In Pencil Tools allows you to draw lines and shapes. Why? Because it is used it much that the same way as you would use your real pencil to draw on a piece of paper, then to apply smoothing or strengthening to the lines and shape as you draw. Select the drawing mode for the pencil tool in the bottom of the tools panel. So we have to try this. Number one, select the pencil tool. Two, from the properties panel, select the stroke color, line, weight, and style, and select drawing mode under the options in the tool panels. Next is the strengthen draws in straight lines and convert the up approximations of triangles, ovals, circles, rectangles, and squares into these common geometric shapes. In by smooth draw smooth curved lines. Ink draws freehand lines with no modifications applied. Number three, to draw straight line with a pencil tool, shift in drag to con train line to either vertical or horizontal directions we have the strengthen the smooth and the ink and that is particularly the example of strengthen smooth and ink now let's move on for the brush tools in the brush tool brush like the strokes using the Brush tool you can create special effects including the calligraphic effects. Let's try this. One, select the brush tool. From the properties panel, select a fill color. Then click the brush mode modifier and select the painting mode. We have the part of the brush tool. One is a paint normal. By in paint normal, paints over lines and fills on the same layer. While the paint fills, paint fills its empty areas, leaving lines unaffected. While the paint behind, 
paints its black areas of the stage on the same layer, leaving lines and fills unaffected. The paint selection applies a new fill to selections when you select fill in the fill color control or the fill box of the properties inspector. That the same selected the fill area and applying a new fill and a fill inside. Paints that fill in which you are start brush stroke and never paints line. If you start painting in an empty area, the fill doesn't affect any existing field area. Four, select brush size and brush shape from the brush tool modifiers. Five, drag on the stage to contrast brush stroke to horizontal and vertical directions. Ship, drag. Next is shapes. We have the particular parts in the shapes tools. We have rectangle tool, rounded triangle tool, ellipse tool, polygon tools, line tool, and custom shape tool. The shape tool is allowed to you add graphic shapes in the form of field layer with a vector's mask, a solid field or fat outline. Using the shape tools, you can draw rectangular, rounded rectangular, elliptical, polygon, light, or custom shapes. Why? Because this some parts of plus CS6 allows you to draw the different shapes with the use of rectangle tool, oval tool, rectangle or primitive tool, oval primitive tool, and polystar tool. Let's move on for the rectangle tool. Rectangle tools allows you to draw rectangular shapes by the vector and fixed cell based in the fat shapes outlines. Draw the center out position that cross hairs where you want to center of the shape or the fat and then drag diagonally to any corner. But take note, you can also specify rounded corners. So you have to try this. To draw the symmetrical score square, hold down the shift key when dragging the rectangle tool on the stage. To draw the rectangle shape from the center of rather than from the left corner, hold down the Alt key and then after drawing the rectangle, you, you use the free transform tool to modify the rectangle path and to select and reposition the rectangle without changing its path. Use the selection tool. In the circle, you have to try this, that you have to draw the symmetrical circle. Hold down the shift key when dragging the oval tool on the stage to draw the oval shape from the center rather than from the left corner. Hold down the alt key and after the drawing the, the, the circle, you have used the pre transform tool to modify the oval path. So to select the reposition of that of changing of this symmetrical circle, use the selection tool. In the rectangle primitive tool, this tool is used to create more complex shapes based on the rectangle. Why? Because that is a close of cousin of the oval primitive tool is the rectangle primitive tool which gives you a control over corner. In Oval Primitive Tool, it used to draw ovals which can be edited using the handles in the tool. Why? Because if you need more complex shapes based on an oval, this tool must be used. When Oval Primitive Tool, you can draw basic oval and then modified angle and reduce the settings on the properties and panel create the the pie or shapes open the curves. In working much the same way as the oval and rectangle tools, the new polystar tools allows you to easily create complex vector shapes. You can use also these tools to create polygons and stars with up to 32 sides.
choose between creating a polygon or a star. Why? Because it enables to draw both polygons in the star shapes. Now let us try for that. No? For the example, the fills can be created with the paint brush tool and the paint bucket tool. So the over rectang rectangle and pin tool can create shapes with the either stroke or a fill of both. In the fill color and stroke color tools, the stroke color tools lets you choose a color for the strokes made from the pen, pencil, and light tool. While the fill color tools for the fill made brush and paint bucket tools. And these tools are also applicable in shapes in hex value field, the alpha value, no color button, lens color picker, swatch menu pop up with the default web 216 colors. So in the Photoshop, eraser tools can be found in the second group of the icon in the toolbox. It has three the variation like the eraser background, eraser, magic eraser. So the eraser is basically a brush which erases pixel as you drag it across the images pixels are erased to tra transparency or the background color if the layer is black. So that is the, the eraser. So eraser tools are primarily used to erase the sections of artwork. When you click the eraser tools, three options we offer in the tall panels, then erase mood, pause set, and eraser shape. We have the erase normal. In erase normal, you have to erase strokes and fills on the same layer. While the erase fills, erase only fill strokes are not affected. Erase lines also erases only the strokes fills are not affected erase select fills or erase only the currently selected fill and does not be affect stroke selected or not and lastly erase inside in that particularly erases only the fill on which you can be begin to erase the stroke so that is from the form of erase mood the faucet eraser shape Before I leave, I give you some thoughts for you. I love retouching images on Photoshop by Troy7. That's end of my lesson. This is Rinaldo B. Malimban. Thank you and goodbye.